Frank Landis? Yes. Crystal Rose? No. Mary Ritter? No. Tim Track? Yes. Motion oh. carries three eight. Two names. Anything other than TransCanada getting their preferred route was a huge victory for pipeline fighters today. We've been able to stop it a couple times. We can stop it again. We're gonna keep fighting and that pipe will never go in the ground in Nebraska. Over 150 different tribal nations in Canada and across this country. We're gonna stand together and continue to fight this pipeline up and down this route. We must call for an end to drought dirty fossil fuels and all associated infrastructure. Let's work together to stop KXL pipeline, but also other tar sands infrastructure projects proposed across Mother Earth and Turtle Island today. It threatens our lands, it threatens our waters, but everything that comes with it threatens our people. They want to build that pipeline right through the heart of the Oglala Aquifer, which is the water source for the breadbasket of the, of the Americas. We're going to stop them. We'll continue to build Solar XL in the route to put clean energy where they want to put this dirty pipeline. It's time for our warriors to start standing up this time. We thank you for your support of Mother Earth and continue to stand against KXL. It's just the tip of the colonizer's spear. We'll continue to resist all the way from South Dakota all the way through Nebraska as long as we have to, doing whatever we have to do in order to, to fight. Who's going to stand up to protect the Earth? We will! We will!